Hi, welcome back. I just wanted to make another video since no one is posting about creaking displays on YouTube, so I guess I will fill the gap with this one. As you can see, I have two versions and compared to the previous version, this one is bigger, it's faster and should be more precise. It's a bit bulky because as I said in the last video, this is not my type of redstone and I will show you how it works now. Like in the previous video, you can move your cursor to move the pixel and this is not 100% precise because the creakings actually view the cursor in a sphere so actually this right creaking is looking at this curved line and not at the line here and I plan to fix this in the future version uh, as you can see I can also click this helmet to wear it and this will actually leave a permanent pixel on in this spot and you can do it anywhere you want you can also turn the pixel off as you can see and I will now speed up the game to show you you can actually kind of draw some stuff in the second version you can see where you're actively looking at and using the helmet will again draw a pixel and if you want to automate it, you can throw a snowball and it will draw whenever you look all the time. And if you want to clear the screen, you can drink milk. And I will just print the game to show you how it works. It's pretty fun to use. I also want to show you a different example for where you can use the creaking tech and here where usually you will have to hit the notebox on the left or right to move the pad you now can just simply look wherever you want it to be and you can see the platform is slowly moving before I end this video I want to say that the word download will be available in the description and I will be uploading the code I use for creaking placement to github and I encourage everyone to try it out and build something themselves. And that's it for the video. I hope you liked it and I will see you in the next one.